Hey, it's D.B. Richards once again from the 2300 Wrestling Podcast. I am with my guest. What up, I'm got a dad bod. Nice to be here. Always in a competitive mood. Got a nice classic board game right here. Yes, yes, this is fun. Yes. See how fun this is? 100% fun. So I always let my guests go first. I appreciate that. Yes. Sportsman like comics. Yes, yes, yes. Love it. Boom. So, what got you in the pro wrestling? Um, I what got me in the pro wrestling. Uh, I like to beat people up, and uh, when you do it through wrestling, the cops don't come. <laughs> That's very true. That's very true. That's true. Uh, you know, I really just—it seems I have a real aptitude for it. Uh, you know, just I don't want to—I I don't want to be a Joe Blow just going to your nine to five all the time. Like I want to be a professional wrestler. Like it's more than just a violence. Gotcha. Like, for sure. What what promotion were you into growing up? Um. So when it was like growing up, I had cable. So it was um. It's my turn. Yes. Oh my bad. My bad. Oh, right, you're good. You're good. So it was like you had Brawl on. You had uh, the SmackDown, but back in the day, I had Comcast Cable, and they yeah. had uh, like a sports section, and I found Impact Wrestling through yeah. there. Uh, oof, I almost forgot to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> um, and so I found like like when Jeff Hardy went there and he was freaking with like a bitch and so I seen like hardcore stuff through that and then uh, I stopped for a while um, I think a lot of people do uh, oh, you missed the whole thing <laughs> uh, but then uh, around like 2014-ish I got back into it and uh, um you know, it was chill, man. Uh, and then I found out about, like, overseas wrestling. And I found out about just everything. It, it turned out wrestling is much larger than I thought it was. And it just exposed me to yeah. so much. So, you work at the Monster Factory. Sweet. What was the best advice Danny Cage ever gave you? Uh, shut the fuck up. You might learn something. <laughs> I, I swear to God... Um, because it's true, and it's like, if you're talking, then you're not able to focus. Yeah. And when you're not focused, you're going to fuck up. And Always. the last thing you want to do as a professional is fuck up. Oh, we don't want to do that. No, not at all. No. Um, and it, it really, because it's like... It can just be like a nugget of information. It could be the million dollars. And if you're talking and not paying attention, then, you know, you're just going to fucking miss that million dollars and you're going to be oh, broke yeah. the rest of your life. Oh, yeah. So, so what's your, your number one goal? Number one goal? Yes. Um, my immediate goal right now... Uh, build a reputation. Build a reputation. Um, I'm a very long-term planner, and you know, like for a lot of people, they'll be like, put in like 100% effort for like five minutes, and then be disappointed that uh, that there, you know, wasn't immediate re yeah. response. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Immediate gratification. Like for me, I know, like coming into this, I wasn't an athlete. I was just some bum off the couch. Uh, we all we all were. Yep. Yeah. And then uh, I was just like, dang, I, I can you got something for this. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry. I'm so entranced with all this connect board. I know. I started rambling. And I, I I lost track of my thought. So, what's your favorite pay per view you ever watched? Favorite pay per view I ever watched. Uh, let me think. Probably the uh, ECW One Night Stand 2006. Okay. Um, it was like the first, my first introduction to like a rowdy crowd that was like, yeah, and like kind of the counter post. Oh, I just beat you. <laughs> So, Dang. do you have any social media for the fans out there? Yes. Uh, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter under the uh, at sign of uh, God of Dadbot, all one word, all lowercase. 
uh, you know, chill Instagram vibes, chill Twitter vibes, nothing crazy, uh, just pure violence, just pure wrestling all the time. Uh, even though I've lost, I don't want this to be a reflection of me. I'm always going to win in that ring. I'm always going to put in 100%. Uh, but he bested me in the connect for today. Uh, very honorable lose. Hey, this is all about content, getting you out there for the fans to know who you are. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. You know what I mean? This, this is, is great.